Hello everyone, my name is Malika. I'm from Ideas Modular Kitchens and Interiors, Rajori Garden. Today we are in the kitchen of uh, one of our uh, clients, Mrs. Sony, whose kitchen is uh, more than uh, four years old. This is a great example of a well-organized uh, small kitchen. And today we are going to explain to you exactly how she did it, so that she could take up the maximum space and storage space in her uh, slightly unconventional small kitchen. So let's go. So first she's taken uh, the, uh, the wall cabinets up to the loft and she's taken them in a light colour so that the room doesn't become heavy. Uh, then as you can see in this uh, she has taken uh, normal shelves and uh, then even in this she's taken normal shelves but then after that she's taken a roller shutter in which she can keep her appliances and all the slightly occasionally, uh, all the other slightly occasionally used uh, goods that are kept here so that uh, the counter space can be empty and clean. Then after that she's taken a normal corner shutter in which uh, she has used it up till the dead end. So you can see that all the space has been taken up and used. Then after that uh, she's taken uh, some of our internal fittings like the cutlery tray to make sure that all of her cutlery is uh, divided and organized uh, in a very nice manner which is easy to use and you know while it's cooking actually it assists them. Then she's dedicated one entire thin drawer for her spices. You can do the same. We, this is generally how we design our kitchens in which we try to give you at least two to three uh, of uh, the drawers for your cutlery then your spices and then your uh, heavy bottomed and uh, other uh, regularly used utensils. Then after that she's taken a fitting in the corner so that uh, and as you can see that this corner actually is a great fitting because uh, it uh, because uh, you can access that dead end which otherwise would you would not have been able to use regularly and makes it possible uh, to be used almost every day without any problems. Then she's taken two bottle pull-ups, uh, one each uh, for all of uh, her cooking and oil needs. Then she's taken a normal dustbin, the dish rack as you can see is attached inside. And then we've got uh, the GTPD above. And uh, I think the one great unique feature that has been taken up in this particular kitchen is that uh, since it is a smallish kitchen and uh, generally we can't make a U-shaped kitchen in this size, we have chosen to take a very very thin cabinet on the other side in which uh, they have utilized some space as well as uh, got a little more counter space uh, for their appliances. And this is a bifold, a glass bifold that she's taken. Uh, to you know, add a little more colour and panache to the entire kitchen. Uh, we're very thankful to Mrs. Sonti for giving us the chance to design this unique space and uh, being part of it.